off. Tonight, attorneys general across the country, including here in Wisconsin, are turning up the heat on automakers Kia and Hyundai. The effort comes as the car theft crisis of those two brands continues to damage lives. CBS 58's Victor Jacobo has the details on what officials are doing to address a problem that we have covered so many times here at CBS 58, Victor. More than 20 attorneys general led by Wisconsin's AG Josh Call signed a letter to Kia and Hyundai calling on the automakers to take swift action to do more when it comes to the ongoing car theft crisis. It comes as Milwaukee leaders take steps to try to help victims. The letter says the recent customer service campaigns from Kia and Hyundai for things like software upgrades are, quote, long overdue and still not enough. Of what we've seen from Kia and Hyundai in response to this issue, which is dragging their feet and refusing to accept responsibility. They also point blame on the automakers for including anti-theft immobilizers as standard equipment on the same models sold outside the U.S., but not in ones sold stateside. Milwaukee was one of the first communities impacted and has seen progress in its battle against auto theft, but more work remains. And so far, auto thefts are continuing to decline uh, this year as well, and that's uh, positive. Uh, even so, older Kias and Hondas uh, are still targeted. The Milwaukee Common Council will vote Tuesday to authorize the city attorney to begin the process to find a remedy for the city and victims of Kia and Hyundai car thefts. Anything that will make um, our constituents as whole as possible and recoup any services and resources spent on stolen cars related to Kia and Hyundai for the fact that they've been that easy to steal. One recent Milwaukee victim of car vandalism and apparent car theft attempt says she and others she knows want their sense of security back. What would make me whole is to be able to park my car anywhere in Milwaukee and feel safe to do so. Now, Kia sends CBS 58 a statement saying it is grateful for the chance to share what it has done already and what it continues to do to address the issue. Kia says it is committed to working with these officials and law enforcement agencies to ensure vehicle safety. Hyundai is sending a similar message in a statement saying it is committed to the quality and integrity of its products and continues to support communities affected by the issue. We're going to have the full statements from both brands on our website and more information they provided on our website where you can find it at cbs58.com. In studio, Victor Jacobo, CBS 58 News.